Oh yeah. So let's be talking like wait. Oh what's yeah. Like? What's Aaron. Like? Show me how you dance real quick. Ready? Yeah. Shake shake the left side. That's your best side. Right there. Alright, that's nice. Hey Lo. What's up, man? <laughs> We've gotten away with all these crimes already. Petty crime, like thieving, just stealing things, breaking in, like Oh yeah, man, yeah we have. I Good point. I've been thinking about like what if we try to commit the perfect crime. What, like kill someone? Like kill someone, like, I think we should try and kidnap them. We should try to kidnap them, but then just kill them. I think we could get away with we it. We wouldn't get caught then. We're not gonna get caught. We're two smart teenagers, and we're on top of the world. Let's do whatever the hell we want. I took an IQ test. I got 210. Oh! That's per so that's enough to kill someone. Yeah. Alright, let's do it, man. Let's go. Wait, who are we gonna kill? D don't you have a cousin? What is that 14-year-old punk's name? Robert? Robert. Talking about little Bobby? Bobby Franks! Dude, I hate that kid! Dude, I think he's in school. You wanna go pick him up? Yeah, let's do that. No, wait, we gotta plan this for months. Alright, let's plan for months. Has it been a month yet? Three months later. Month got later. it! Perfect let's... crime. It's all It's all planned out. We're gonna take him, put him in the car, and we'll just improv it from there. We'll just do it. We'll try to kidnap him, but if we kill him, I got who an idea. cares? Hydrochloric acid. Can't identify him, um, man. All right, good. I'll try not to leave anything at the scene. Let's not leave anything at the scene. That's the most we'll important. We'll burn our clothes after we do this. We'll take his clothes, burn those. We'll burn everything that is linking us between them. All right, let's do it. Let's go. Let's drive. <laughs> we're here. Yo, Lo, we're pulling up to... Uh, your uh, relatives or distant relatives uh, school now, dude. All right. Um, we'll we'll get him in the car, and then we'll work from there. All right. All right. Ready? Let me, let me get in this seat. We'll have him come in on the right side. All right. All right. We're there. All right. All right. Whew. All right. Let's do this. No messing up. Hey, Bobby. Bobby. Oh, hey, guys. Hey, what's up, guys? What's up, dude? Oh, you're in the car. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, hey, come on in. Come on in. Your door. No. Okay. Hey, we're we're going to these woods. We're gonna show you this cool thing. Oh, what, what is it? Sir, sir, what? Jesus, come on! Quick, Jesus! Where's the sock? Oh, 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 sir! Ah. Ah. What do we do? What do we do? All right, I got some uh, hydrochloric acid in the woods. It'll decompose his face and. Alright, let's do it. Alright, ready? One sec. He's a, he's a heavy one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let me get the hydrochloric. Watch out. My leg's on the wall. Oh my god. Rub it around, rub it around. <laughs> oh dude, it burns, it burns, uh, it burns. Uh, Alright, uh... Alright, let's go, let's get out of here. Alright, let's, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm in America, I'm in America. All the way from Poland, in the middle. Oh, oh me amigo, what is going on over here? Are you okay, sir? I got to... Sir, what is... Oh, what are these? Glasses. Oh, there's blood on the sock! What are you going to do? I'm going to call the police. I'm going to call the police, man. Okay. I don't want. There's a, there's a dead person on the ground over here. I don't know what to do. I just got here from Poland. There's dead people on the ground. Uh, just, just give me a crack, okay? <sighs> okay? Detective Byrne here. Here to uphold the law at all costs. What do we have here? Another bum? Get up, sir. You can't be sleeping here. I said get up, sir. I SAID GET UP! He's not getting up. I think he might be dead. What the... What is this? Is it a sock with blood on it? Glasses? These look strikingly familiar. We gotta call a deputy. Deputies! We got a murder case on our hands. Dead man. Over here. Get all squadrons over here now. All right, bye.
found these at the crime scene. Well, we got detective. a uh, strange mechanism on the side. Hopefully you can uh, find out what's going on with those. Oh, these glasses! Yes, these glasses, yeah. Right. There's only three of these in, in Chicago. I sell them. I make these glasses. You make these glasses? Yeah, these are very expensive. Really? I think, uh... Who are the uh, three people that you sold them to? Uh, there was, uh, I don't remember two of them. They were old men. Um, there was Mr. Leopold, though. Mr. Leopold. All right. He has them. Any he calls information the money. you can get what? will help us. I know where they live. You want the address? Yeah, I want the address. Okay. Write it down. Write it down. Officer, I will. Write it down, old man. Ah! 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 Here you go. Come here. Thank you. Goodbye. Ah, who is it? Mr. Lippel? Is that your name? Yeah, why? You're under arrest for the suspected murder and molestation of Robert Franks. Who do you think I am? Get out! Ah! Get out of your hand! Come here. Arms behind your back. Ah! Arms behind your back. Ah! I'm innocent! I'm innocent! No, you're not. Help Shut him! Ah! You're going to be in jail for a long time. Uh. Let's go. Let's... <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I'm sick of these games. All right. Ah! You're going in for a long time. Do you know who my father is? Jack! <laughs> that's right. Yeah. All right. That's right. Detective Byrne. <laughs> I'm Detective Byrne. We have two suspects here. And let me ask a quick question. What's up with the sack on the table right there? I didn't do it. I, I was in the I driver's seat. I have no idea. I was in the driver's seat. What's up with the sack? Just How tell me. How did I do I, anything in the driver's seat? He was in the driver's seat. No, he wasn't. He wasn't. I was driving. One at a time. Thank you. I'm Detective Burns. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Clearly, this sock is not mine. It is... Looks like his foot. I've got both my socks, socks on. It's the key. Same. Look under the table. Uh, Look under the table. I lost my sock. You lost right your sock. Don't ruin the table, mind. first of all. No throwing the evidence. I'm Detective Burns. The chisel. The chisel. Look at it. Don't. It's perfectly in his hand. It, Touch the chisel. chisel. He's got a glove on. The chisel fits perfectly in your hand. No, I don't. He's got one glove. I don't know what he's talking about. All right, don't touch the chisel. Look at it. Don't touch the chisel. I'll bite you. Alright, what? What, Mr. Byrne? What's her sentence? Mm. Alright, let me ask you one more time. What happened with the chisel? Who used it and I why? Used it. And I'll admit it, I used the sock. We you both? both? We plead guilty. I plead guilty. I plead guilty. I plead guilty. I plead guilty. I'm Detective Ferns. You pleaded guilty. That's fantastic. I'll see you in court. I'm the Circuit Court Judge John Cameron. According to the defense, we both pled guilty. guilty Due to this evidence, settle down. Due to this evidence, once what evidence? Order in the court. Sorry. Settle down. I have the evidence in a bag. I will get to that in a second. Settle down, or I will smack the. Mm -hmm. And I have a scarf. Due to this evidence that I will present, <laughs> one sentence down. To life imprisonment for the murder and 99 years for the kidnapping of the late Robert Franks. That boy was so young, buddy. You idiots. How do you plead? Oh, one more time, let me hear. Guilty. Guilty. That's what I thought. We have some evidence that I present to you. Let me see what we have in our bag of tricks here. You tricksters. We have a sack used in the suffocation. Oh, no. You've got proof. Your fingerprints aren't on the sock, but we have DNA. Let's go to the next piece of evidence in my bag. We have the chisel. Now, you used it several times on the poor son of a bitch. <laughs> I already pled guilty. Put Why are you trying to suffocate me? <laughs> All right, we have a chisel, like I was trying to say, and this is not right. That should not be thrown about. It could hurt someone. Where are we going? Like Bobby Franks. Oh, Bobby. 
You guys feel bad for what you've done? Nope. 99 years! It's a perfect crime. 99 years! We almost got away with it! We would've got away with it! If it wasn't for you meddling judges! I have a blue scarf. There you go. I'll take that and take it. Black! Of this trial, I am a lawyer. That defendant might not be guilty of his crime because of it inherited traits. Lepold and Lowen were broken machines. <laughs> have God have pity on their soul. I'm Clarence Darrow. Thank you.